all right let's see how to implement swipe to refresh or pull to refresh so for that let's get into the layout of user profile activity and then we will have to define swipe refresh layout and we have to make it as the parent of all the views so we can just choose it from here android x dot swipe refresh layout dot widget dot swipe refresh layout And then we can cut our scroll view and then paste it inside the swipe refresh layout. Let me remove this XMLNS app because it is not needed anyway. And let's add one ID to the swipe refresh layout. We need to get one ID. And uh, we need to cut these two lines XML NS colon Android. This XML NS declares a namespace, which means XML namespace, and uh, it is used for providing uniquely named elements and attributes in an XML document. And it is used like this because it is a design choice by Google to handle the errors at compile time. So we can just cut these two statements here and paste them in the swipe refresh layout and uh, let me add android colon here now we don't have any error all right now let's get into the java class of user profile activity and right after setting the title for the activity we have to set up the swipe to refresh so i will just use one method for that and then create the method now the first thing is to look for a swipe container so let's say swipe container equals find view by id and the id that we have used with the swipe to refresh layout is swipe container then let's declare the swipe container globally all right then we have to set up the refresh listener so we will use swipe container dot set on refresh listener and then we will define one on refresh listener now all the code to refresh the activity goes inside the on refresh method so we will just use start activity get intent so it will get the intent of the same activity that is the user profile activity and then we will finish the current activity so that the new activity takes over and then if you don't want any animation then we can overwrite the pending transitions like we have done it before then after that we have to set the set refreshing to false then coming outside of the on refresh listener we have to configure the refresh colors that is the colors which are displayed when we swipe in the activity So swipe container dot set color scheme resources android dot r dot color dot holo blue bright then holo green light. then holo orange light and then finally holo red light 
let's run the app all right now we are getting some error let me check the error attribute xml ns android was already specified for element all right let's get back to the layout and check what is our problem here we have defined the namespace twice so we can just get rid of one of them and run the app once again let's log in since we have already deleted the profile let me register quickly Now if you swipe down you can see the swipe to refresh and the activity is getting refreshed so which means now that we have a shortcut for refresh we can get rid of this refresh icon Alright, 